nothing good can come out from IPOP because they are bent in causing confusion. Joe Igbokwe tell IPOP. Anytime I go to work or coming back, all I see in most Nigerian newspapers, especially electronic media, is IPOP insulted one elder. IPOP treating Ohanese in the Igbo. I laugh because I already know that nothing good can come out from that group of terrorists. Insulting and threatening your leaders is a hate speech. It's against the law and it's high time government start looking into the way IPOP insults the president of Haneze Indibu, leaders and Nigerians at large. I reject Biafra. IPOP must up right from day one because they are of no use in any way to our country, Nigeria. Rather, they are bent on causing confusion everywhere. Most Igbos in APC, especially those who attended the Nigerian Democracy Day celebration in Lagos last week, where I made it known to all that we only have one nation, and that is Nigeria. Every one nation or every other nation is counterfeit. I love their zeal in seeing reasons with me as an elderly person because most of those gullible youths Namdekanu is deceiving won't see nor understand what I am saying. I will continue to make it known to them that I am not a Biafran but a true citizen of Nigeria. Thank you for listening to this news. Well, um, my viewers, I don't, I don't really want us to bother ourselves so much on um, on um, issues concerning Joe Ibokwe because he has been the, an enemy of Biafra from day one. He is, in fact, number one enemy of Biafra. And uh, he has never for once said anything good about the Republic. He is one of those Igbo leaders. In fact, he is the direct number one Igbo leader they are talking about that has been praying for the downfall of, um, of the Republic. But then he has failed. He has really failed. He has failed in essence that a typical Igbo man of his kind cannot even see see things with even with his even with even with his two eyes opened. Its two eyes are open, yet he cannot see clearly. I think he has been bewitched by the Fulani, um, by the, by the Fulani witches, so so that he will not see clearly what is coming after him. Believe me, you take it or leave it. It will be too late by the time, um, by the time they finish him. You see, he's still enjoying his uh, his position his position in the in the administration and that is what is giving him so much guts to rant and um, and um, talk say all kind of um, rubbish from his mouth you can imagine the statement their friends are bent in causing confusion who is the confusionist here is he he Joe Igbokwe or the Biafrans. Biafrans are not Confucianists and they have never been a Confucianist. They are they they they, they have been what Biafrans are requesting for is a republic and that's all. If only they can grant Biafran their request. No prop. Every other thing can 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 stay. You understand? Biafrans are not demanding for so, for too much. 
Biafrans are not requesting for too much. What Biafrans are requesting is freedom. Freedom, let them be. The actualization, the Republic has fought for so long. What is now delaying their freedom? Nothing. Nothing rather than greediness and selfishness of the Nigerian leaders. They don't want the 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 uh, the, the Biafrans to go because they are still enjoying the resources that they have. People of Joy Ibokwe are one of the betrayals that they use in tapping the southeast resources. Uh, Uzodima is another factor that they are making use of. That is why they keep promoting him and giving him key positions and uh, making him head of different departments. Just of recent, he was made the head of the committee to 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 work with um, the with the Edo primary election. You can see. So, the Fulani president is making use of them, so as for them not to see clearly what they they are actually planning for them. You understand? We can the Biafrans can never be in support of one Nigeria because um, Nigeria as a country has has already failed, has failed. The country has failed and um, there is no way Biafran can be a party to a failed country. You understand? Biafran can never be a party to a failed country. Nigeria has as um as disappointed so many people including the Igbos. the Igbos has been intimidated and so much pushed to the war and it's, it's so painful that people like uh, joe Ibokwe cannot even see this even with their eyes wide open it's so much a pity and i'm totally disappointed in that I'm totally disappointed in that. Well, um, no problem. No problem. The most important thing is the um, the continuous movement of the actualization. Unlike um, the, uh, the coming agitation that will be coming up after the, after the lockdown is completely relaxed. I would say that Biafrans should um should have, should make it uh a peaceful agitation of which um i want to believe that um, it is going to bring uh, is going to promote the republic and make the republic um to be known once more in all over the world though it has been known but then it to bring an extension, you understand? It to bring an extension, so that people like Joe Ibokwe, Hope Uzodima, and other enemies of Biafra, unlike um, Nia Umo Chief Nia Umodo, we have their mouth shut. We have their mouth shut. So I want to use this medium to crave the indulgence of um, of of. Um, members of IPOP to to remain absolute they must not be distracted for by for for not for anything right they should remain absolute and remain focused nigeria nigerian is on its own course while biafrans are also on their own course so in no due time very soon the trumpet will sound and everyone will be on its own and they will now see who truly is telling the truth you understand so we don't need to um to argue much about this what we just need to do 
is just remain remain focused and um, and start working and continue working towards the right direction so um, my viewers